I wish it was cold enough in LA to wear those fur coats again now, because uh, Lord knows, I'd be having all crazy colors, different like patterns, cheetah. I'd be like, that's what I pimp shit for real. <laughs> Yo, what's good? It's your boy, 24 Karat Golden, and we're here at Wild Style taking a look at some jackets, hoodies, and other outerwear today. Let's get it. It's just crazy right here. Peep this, it's like a crew neck, but like a hoodie, but also like Davy Jones, like lockers at the same time. Yes, that real Pirates of the Caribbean drip. See what else they got. I think like just outerwear, I think outerwear and jeans, in my opinion, are the most important pieces of the outfits. Just because like, it's what is most immediately visible, you know? Because if you're wearing a shirt or something, it might be covered up. Because growing up in San Francisco, like outerwear was always really, really big for me because it's always gonna be cold. You always need a jacket. So if you're gonna have a jacket, you might as well have the freshest jacket out. The best jacket trend of all time is, was the fur coats. Like just when everyone was wearing those like Cameron's pink jacket. That's iconic, um, super big, like long fur coats. That was like some real like luxe, like real high class, just like elegant. It's, it's some next level. I wish it was cold enough in LA to wear those fur coats again now, cause oh Lord knows, I'd be having all crazy colors, different like patterns, cheetah. I'd be like, that's what I picked for real. <laughs> Nah, San Francisco is like relative, like you always need a jacket because if it's sunny, that's only gonna last a couple hours. So you, you just count your blessings. This one right here is super tight. I like how to use like a bunch of different materials. Got some nylon, you know, some fleece. And just the color blocking is cool too. Like back fleece, front fleece, like very minimal logos. That's the type of shit I like. I like that's either like really low key or like really high key. Let's take a look at some other jackets. This is really That's high key. key. This is high key. I could wear this with this outfit right here. I might have to do it to him. <laughs> Let's see. This is balling, balling on a budget friendly. Nah, this is not balling on a budget friendly. All right, if you guess how much, if you guess uh, how much this jacket costs, I'll follow you back on Instagram. Leave it in the comments. <laughs> I feel like a, a lot of designer brands like LV, Gucci, Dior, all that, like their most fire shit does not even go to stores. Like the, like it's just get pre-ordered by people that, you know, have good relationships with the stores. And then all that's left is just kind of the okay stuff. Uh, I really like Montclair, just their like glossy bubble jackets. In terms of like, for me, when I shop, it's less about the brand and more about the style. So I like zip up hoodies a lot just because I like to layer with like a wife beater or a t-shirt or something like that. So with a zip up hoodie, it's easy to have something on the graphic on the hoodie as well as something on the graphic in the tee. And if they like intermingle with that heavy, uh, I like jail jackets a lot, like just simple zip ups with a collar and like a canvas or nylon material. But windbreakers like the North Face, like the Chief Keef eras and the Supreme Collab ones uh, I've been talking about, those just go super crazy to me. Yeah, a winter jacket generally is my vibe. Let's see what else we got here today. My favorite jacket story? Uh, the jacket I was, I was wearing this pink jacket earlier. I got this pink jacket that says uh, Catalina Island on it and like the sickest like script font and it's like the perfect color pink, perfect fit and everything. And I got it actually on Catalina Island and I was trying to find it on eBay cause I kind of messed it up and I couldn't find it anywhere else. So literally, if I want to get this jacket again, I need to go take an hour ferry ride to Catalina Island. And I'm probably going to do it like next weekend or something like that, just because. <laughs> Look at the fit of them. Ain't nobody's legs are these long in real life. They do that shit on purpose. Yeah, with the shoes, I think it would hit perfectly. This is a fit. This is a fit. This is a fit. All right, let's do it. Today's a shopping day. Me too, size is on. I had to do it to him. <laughs> Thank you. Have a great day, y'all.